To write the formula for chromium 4 phosphate, let's first write the element symbol here for chromium. That's just CR. And the 4 here, this Roman numeral 4 in parentheses, that means that we'll have a 4 plus on the chromium here. So here's our chromium. The phosphate, this ATE, you won't find that on the periodic table. This is a polyatomic ion. So you either memorize that the phosphate ion is PO4 and has a charge of 3 minus, and that's on the whole phosphate ion. Or if you're allowed, you look this up on a table of polyatomic ions. So because chromium is a metal, it's a transition metal, and then phosphate, that's a group of nonmetals, a polyatomic ion, we have an ionic compound here. So these charges, these charges here, they have to balance, give us a net charge of zero. We can use something called the crisscross method to make that a lot easier. We'll move the three down here, and the four, we'll move that out here. Let's get rid of these symbols. And because we have four of these phosphate ions here, we need to put parentheses around the phosphate. So that makes this the formula for chromium 4 phosphate, Cr3PO44. But let's check our work real quick. We said we had 4 plus on the chromium, each chromium here because of this Roman numeral. And then we said the whole phosphate is 3 minus. 4 times 3 minus, that's 12 minus. 3 times 4 plus, that's 12 plus. These two numbers, they add up to 0, give us a net charge of 0. So this is the correct formula for chromium 4 phosphate. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.